probably want to land uphill and launch downhill. Well, here we are. <laughs> oh, I love landing weird places. Hi, I'm Judson Graham. Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to do something a little bit different. I think I say that every single time. We have a MacFly trike over there. And Trevor's been flying it. Do you like it? Yes. And I flew it a couple times and I like it. I like flying trikes. So I don't just fly a trike like I fly a normal motor. Take off, go frolic around that mountain, carve it up fly the Jin Carve 2 18 meter and hopefully go around the mountain, or over the mountain, around it, over the front, back this way. Does that sound like a good flight? Yeah. This is the MacFly trike. It has shiny wheels. All I have to do is just slide one piece of the motor in here, other pieces of the stand fall right here, three pins, and then it's on. Oh, it just wasn't slid all the way back. Oh, oh there we go. Bingo. Much easier. That's it. Trevor, I would give the assembly of this trike an easy out of 10. There's the mountain. Mountain, mountain. Like no matter what I say, somebody in the comments is either like, there's no T in mountain. And then somebody's like, why can't you pronounce T? What do you say? Mountain. mountain. Totally stuck. can also land. <laughs> I have wheels to drag. I can't do foot drags, but I can do wheel drags. I wonder if I'll land somewhere. Midair glove insulation brought to you by the off-grid aviation throttle cruise control. Dude, the carve is so good. What the heck? So because you're flying the same hang point, your same motor, when you put one of these strikes on, you're basically flying exactly the same as you would normally. You still have the weight shift. It's a little less but then you just have the trike below you. But I feel like a lot of people's complaints with trike is they're gonna end up like not being able to fly with the same freedom of a foot launch, and I don't think that's true. I think maybe landing zone wise, yeah, it might end up with a little bit of an interesting situation, but overall, totally fine. I like how the car, even though it's so dynamic, I'm hands off and it's not oscillating at all. by Grizz. New song. Great. I think the wind's coming ever so slightly this way. It would be so cool to land up here. <laughs> oh, I'm on the top of a mountain! <laughs> Mom, I'm doing it! Wow, there's a lot of infrastructure up here. I thought this was just like a pretty blank mountain, but lots of radio towers be a suitable launching zone right here down this road I want to land that's that's my goal oh, this is so exciting for me I've really been like terrified to do flights like this uh, genuinely this is the first time I've felt like, comfortable. a little bit trepidatious trepid is that the right word trepid leave a comment sweet tower you could speed fly this. this you could definitely speed fly this it would be a really short flight that looks really nice for landing. I'm gonna scope that out. I can do a touch and go and see how I like the feeling. 
Now, always with, with the western stuff, the grass looks so inviting and then it ends up being not as inviting as you think. Probably want to land down uphill and launch downhill. the wind direction matters less. Well, here we are. <laughs> oh, I love landing weird places. <laughs> Little craggy. Here we are, top of a mountain. What a scene. <laughs> now, I think the move is to launch right down this road. Oh, there is some wind. Interesting. Okay, which way is the wind going? Crosswind. It's coming that way, as, as I expected. Well, this is cool. Didn't think I'd be up here this morning. I've wanted to be up here for a while. Maybe I should run up to the edge. Whew. Oh, man. Altitude's taking that of me. <laughs> quite the view. I landed on a mountain. Heck yeah. We're gonna launch this way. I'm gonna go way down there. It looks like the wing can spread across the dirt road perfectly. Hopefully there's nothing too crazy. Definitely bumpy. And I can't roll through this. So I have to take off on this road. Oh, yeah. Okay, these lines are clear. And one thing you can do is, like, rosette the lines on either side. And put all of them on the wing so you know nothing's tangled. It's gonna be a bumpy launch. Clear! All right, here goes nothing. Well, I launched with a twist of the riser, but it's okay. It's totally fine. Whoops. All the lines are still happy though, so we chillin'. very lifty actually. Bridge lift. I'm at idle. Not really going down. A little bit of brake applied for some lift. I wonder if we go around the front here it'll be a little poppier. Probably gonna change as we get into the sunlight. Not really. Carve is nice and just a little bumps. Hmm, I could go the long way around this town. I also wonder if there's a spot so I can land without the shade of having a twisted riser at the field. <laughs> Oh, it's so lifty. In the morning, the cold side of the mountain, which is still, I'm on the, I'm on the north side, well, really the west side, but whatever. It stays colder longer, so there's this cold air sinking off the mountain. It's flowing down, and that'll stop happening soon after the sun comes up, but right now I can still feel like the difference between the catamatic flow, which is really cold air, usually pretty smooth, but with like the natural flow of everything. vertigo on that. Hot dang. Oh, 
Boing, 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 boing. Oh, I nailed that wind direction. Don't you dare fall on me. Don't you dare. Good job. <laughs> so my philosophy with just launching with the riser twist, I saw it on inflation, was that was a pretty committing launch and took a lot of time to set up. And the wing was good. And the likelihood of the wing being perfect and inflated is not 100%. It was crosswind, but I just happened to get a cycle where I was perfectly into the wind. So I chose just deal with the riser twist, which honestly, was totally fine. I just want to let my trimmers out at some point, but I would have rather launched with that, with a good wing into the wind off that, than try to reset, possibly tangle lines, possibly damage stuff. So that was the mentality there. There's a song on that's really good. I gotta, I gotta save it. Oh, new playlist, funk jam. So funky it hurts. Dude, I was up there, and now I'm here, and the trike rips. A little nerve wracking on the lawn. Definitely launch with a riser twist on that side, but uh, I landed and fixed it so no one saw it. I like the trike a lot. I'm gonna fly it more. It's so easy to fly. Use a leg rest. <laughs> I was pretty happy. I think the only thing with the trike that would be like you can't do as much as high wind stuff. Like if you were trying to reverse off a tight spot. You saw, you saw it does barrel rolls. You ripped it. Super easy. Ripped it. We gotta get Trevor up on that carve mobile. All right. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope you, I hope you enjoyed that. I'm not even gonna say, I know you enjoyed that. If you're here, you enjoyed that. That's the cool thing. I'll be doing this more. Happy to see you. Leave a comment if you're happy to see me. All the new people here, you're cool. Thank you and welcome. Oh,